What's up, it's your man LR. And welcome to Why I Quit Need for Speed Undercover. Yeah, this is how I kick off on some fast and furious shit running from the cops. Digging the GTR. Yeah, remember this car, cause uh yeah, you won't be starting the game with this. This is just a little bullshit intro. <laughs> but anyway, I've been a Need for Speed fan since the original Need for Speed on the PC. I think I played two, three, and had like Carbon and a couple others here and there, but I hadn't played in a while. So I was like, hey, they got a remastered version of this. Let me check it out. As you can see, it looks pretty as hell. They did a great job on the remastering. It looks pretty modern for a game that came out in, I think, what, 2008? So dipping on the cops and cars and stuff. So, at this point, everything's looking good. So, we've got the cops, and this is the little gimmick where you can slow down and, like, do tricks and shit or bust through police barricades and stuff like that. So yeah, so the story is cheesy. They got Maggie Q in here. She's like your FBI handler while you're working undercover. Uh, like I said, I didn't even get that far in the game to get into the story, but the story sounded hokey. The FBI is stepping in. I'll be your new point person. We suspect one of the local street racing crew. So anyway, let's get to the racing and what I really hate. So yeah, you see, I'm in a damn Nissan 240SX. Okay. That's not a racing car, but it's a sports car that should have way better acceleration than this bullshit. Dude, my wife's four cylinder Chevy Equinox accelerates better than this. I won't even talk about the many six cylinder cars that I own. That, yeah, probably in the car I ain't did a hundred in. But we we'll keep that between me, you, and the rest of the YouTube world. But like right there, that's my biggest problem with the game, Rubber Bandit. I had a, had a little lead and this motherfucker just flies up out of nowhere like I'm standing still. Now I understand I'm hitting brakes and skidding so you lose some speed. But folks just fly by you like you're standing still. And I got tired of this little jump and cut scene at a point. Like dude, just make the jump. But it seemed to give me a lead. So I would do it a whole lot, but yeah, it's kind of, well, it's going with the whole little movie thing, but then watch, rubber banded me again. As you see, I barely made any mistakes, he flew by me, so got a little scene. Now they driving is a whole nother matter. Now you see, I done drove him way off course, and he just recovers and ends up ahead of me after all of that. Of course, you got the cop things where they slow down, show the cop. But this one here is ridiculous. Now you see me and him battling, and then this joker flies by me. Look, I'm standing still. And then was about to get in second place, and dude fly by me, so I end up in damn third. Yeah, so <laughs> I couldn't do it anymore. I mean, game's pretty. I like racing games, but it's just too much jank for me. The little slow motion crap. Ah, uh, that, that was annoying. I was like, why should I have to do tricks to win a race? Why can't I just win a race on driving skill? Because we got rubber banding and all this other jank going on. That's why. But anyway, yeah, I uninstalled it and I moved on with my life. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> if you want to play it, go ahead. But I warned you first. Deuces. GBA Studio. Oh, 